I'm so nervous. <laughs> So you'll never believe where I'm at today. So I'm at Drag Nights here at Wild Horse. So this is my first time coming to Drag Nights here in Arizona. I've been to the one in Florida a few times back then when I used to live there. So I'm very excited to see how this one is. Now, originally I came here and I was like, let me just come spectate. But last minute I'm like, you know what? Let me run. I'm so used to the road horse at the track. So I'm like, let me try this out for the first time. So I'm excited, but I'm also a bit nervous. <laughs> but let's see how it goes today. I'm not running my Camaro and obviously not in the Shelby because it's not available But I am running in another car which will probably be something exciting I mean at least I'm excited to run it. So it is the Nissan GTR. I will be running this car today This is gonna be my first time here at Drag Nights and also running the GTR. So let's see <laughs> Hopefully I have a good reaction time. That's probably like what I'm mostly nervous about but let's see I'm, I mean I'm a beginner. I'm, I don't know. Let's see. Don't don't judge me people <laughs> I'm nervous, but let's do this. Let's try something new. So right here, we're at the like, I guess the staging area. So that's one of the cars that just ran. They come out from all the way over there. And by the way, this uh, drag strip is part of the of the road course that I've come to, like I think Mondo and the main track. So that's a straightaway that then turns into a road course. But these are all the cars that are at least running. I guess uh, some people bring their trailers here if they can't really drive their cars. So there's a lot of different cars here. And then over there is where the line starts. So in a bit, I'm about to go line up there and uh, <laughs> see how this night goes for me. All right, guys, it's time because the line just keeps getting longer. More cars keep just lining up, so I need to go. It's now or never. <laughs> I have my gloves here. I have my helmet, and uh, <laughs> wish me luck. <laughs> hey guys, we are getting close. <laughs> <laughs> the line just keeps moving. At first it was moving a bit slow, but now it's moving a lot faster. So just these little bit of cars in front of me. And then I can line up over there. So <laughs> I'm so nervous. Alright guys, we're almost there. I think I have like four cars ahead of me. This is so out of my comfort zone. Now this car rubbing so you may not be able to hear me so this is still out of my comfort zone but still I want to try it and see how I how I do and see if I like it I'm just worried about the reaction time Warning is, or sorry, damn. Yeah. <laughs> this here one warning. 
forward and slow it down, right? You're only good to 11.5, you went 21 right there. Okay. Okay, so you gotta slow it back down to 11.5. Okay. okay, all right, thank you. Okay, so I got it to 11.5 since I don't have a, a safe a fire jacket then I need to let off so it's not gonna be a good time it has to be 11.5 or more so let's see but this is gonna be exciting I'm wearing against another GTR even though I have to let off so this is just for fun right now okay so I'm about to go for the second time let me just warn you that this is not gonna be a fast run because I wasn't aware that I can only go 11.5 or higher 11.5 is the fastest that I can do because I don't have the fire jacket well, I'm going again just because it was fun. <laughs> I'm gonna try to let off like three quarters down so I can just get an 11.5. But I'm going against the other GTR and it's just gonna be fun. Two GTR is running <laughs> next to each other. So obviously he's gonna win because he's not gonna let off. He has his fire jacket. But either way, it's so much fun. I am so down to do this again. <laughs>
But either way, I'll see you guys when I get home so I can go over my time. All right, so it's the next day. Well, better said the next night just because last night, I mean, I came home really late and that was pretty much my fault just because I was really trying to get as many runs as possible before they closed the staging line. So by the time I got home, I didn't even realize it was like 1 a.m. and I had to get up extremely early the next day for work. So I was like, man, I'm so tired. I can't record. So here we are today and I do have my time slips with me. So we will go over them now. But before we do, I do have to let you know once again, I mean, pretty new at this well completely new at this i had almost no idea what i was doing all that i knew is that people kept telling me don't red light no don't red light and i was like what does that even mean so either way i had to watch many videos just to prep for me to run down the drag strip and i just understand a few things now we can go over the numbers on the time slips i will be putting them here on the screen so you guys can reference them too so now my first run was 11.2 at 119 miles per hour my reaction time was 0.9 my 60 foot was 1.7 my 660 was 7.2 Two at 99 miles per hour my second one which I had a problem with the GTR it just cut boost so extremely irrelevant but here we go it was 17.1 at 61 miles per hour my reaction time was 1.0 my 60 foot was 1.8 my 660 was 9.6 at 57 miles per hour and my third one which was the last one was 11.6 at 95 miles per hour my reaction time was 0.9 my 60 foot was 1.7 my 660 was 7.1 at 100 miles per hour and one thing that i was actually having an issue with in all runs that you guys will actually see in the video is that i was having issues on where to stage it's because i was having <laughs> issues with understanding pre-staging staging looking at the tree with the lights making sure okay is the other guy stage and my stage because then the lights are going to start counting down so in in all three runs I was either too forward or I was either too back. I have to work on that clearly. I even had to reference videos just to look at these time slips and actually understand what each and every single number means. So overall, I had a really fun time even with those issues. And I do feel like I do want to go again. And before anyone says anything, I do understand that this car was probably like one of the easiest cars for me to learn because I really didn't have to worry about doing a burnout. All I had to do is just stage, be ready, and then just launch it and just go all the way and that's it. So I really did have a lot of fun also with this car. <laughs> Next time, let's see if I can improve my times, improve my reaction i will make sure that i'm actually better prepared so i will have my fire jacket and just everything else that they need in order for me to be able to run faster not to let the foot off the throttle because that was honestly not fun at all <laughs> the first run was really fun but the third one i was like mm. <laughs> so either way let me know what you guys think about my first time here at drag nights i had an awesome time at the quarter mile and i plan to go again but i hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching and i'll see you on the next one